Jason gave the forecast every evening, but he didn't just stay in the weather center. Well, from cooking and eating in the QC <laughs> kitchen here in our studios to his work with the St. Jude Dream Home campaign, Jason Myers was a man who loved to get out in the community and he always did it with a smile on his face. Three, two, one. <laughs> Well, it's an exciting day as we start off the 2020 St. Jude Dream Home here in Kramerton, right along the South Fork of the Catawba River. Take a look here how high the water is. Now, this is an area that was under a flood warning. Do you know how to shuck an oyster? Uh, not really well, but yeah, well, I can always try. Stick around, yeah. stick around, because you're about to learn. You know, I was practicing this the past couple of days because it's a recipe that my grandmother first made, my mom's mom, and then my mom would make. And it's not something that I typically make myself. I would a lot of times eat it. So it's the difference between eating it and, of course, making it. Did we hit the hottest day of the year today? We have, yes. We have so far have hit 90 degrees, Ooh. and that's the first 90 degrees of 2022. By the way, I like you guys' spring colors. You got the yellow, the yeah. Yeah, uh, a nice. Easter, Easter theme going on. Yeah, I, I like it. So I hope I at least get an A for the weather today. It is a great day to be outside. And of course, one of the things that I love to talk about is fitness, physical fitness and fun with physical fitness. Wow. This is amazing. What's amazing is the shower. I mean, yeah, there's multiple ways to get clean here, uh, including the tub. So that is really cool. Take, Can I just take the take, bowl? Take the or, bowl. Wow. Okay. The bowl. That wow. was great. That's great. That's water. very good. Isn't that good? Wow. Yeah. We'll have some fun. Wow. Mm -hmm. yes. All right, job. kids, you got to go do the news yeah. and the weather. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, maybe grab some hot chocolate, huh? Exactly. A little chilly out here, but a lot of fun. I mean, everybody out here, of course, has smiles. We've got the festive music going on. Um, I'm going to try to do a little trick for you guys. There we go. So, uh, yeah, we're having fun out here. Jason, um, just yesterday here on WBTV, his uh, last 6 o'clock newscast with us. It's been an emotionally draining day here at WBTV as all of us here are grieving for Jason and Chip's families. Our team is going to take a brief commercial break, take our breath for just a second. We're back right after this.